Hello, everybody. Thank you for visiting this page. My name is Susanna Hörczak. I'm a psychic and a medium and an intuitive coach. And today I'm going to bring you three answers using my cards. So if you would like to join in, just relax in your body, take a comfortable breath, bring your question to your heart and imagine that this question is leaving your heart so that you are seeing it in front of you, just outside of your body. We are just observing that question. And while I'm shuffling my cards, I'd like you to think about one number, one, two or three, and I'm going to bring you three cards, three numbers, three cards. And um, that will give you hopefully some, some insight. We'll give you some, some insight here. So I'm picking card one, card two, and card three. Okay, so if you are choosing number one, Okay, card number one, I feel what I'm feeling for you is I need to be structured, I need to be in action, and I feel that as I'm moving forward uh, for one week, I feel it's one week ahead of me, I need to be really disciplined in the forthcoming three, four days, and then in a way that it, it, even it might take you working through your question or maybe a project you are working through or conversations you have to have within the family, but you really need to be on task for about three or four days. And then I feel that it might, it might fill your evenings as well. But then what Spit is saying that after that time, then you can really re relax. You can put your, put, put your coat on the peg, so to speak, in the, in, in the sense that you have done everything what you could do or what you could, what, what you could have done. And then I feel that as you are moving forward three and four days, uh, just make sure that you are really concentrating because I feel that there are other energies around you trying to distract your energy trying to distract your attention, but then right, right now we really need to focus. Okay? The, the price is not very, very far. You just have to have that last, last push. Okay? Now what I'm feeling for of once, I feel that this card is really representing now the, the union, the outcome of your effort right now. And then I feel that it, um, it also has a sense that uh, you are quite pleased that you have made this decision a little bit back, going back. And now it is just the last, the final, final completion of your, of, your, um, of your project possibly or something what you need to do. And then I feel that right now Spirit is also asking you to keep your mouth quiet and you need to be a little bit quiet and maybe not, not letting everything, not giving everything out or giving or putting everything out or giving everything away because that comes a little bit later and what I feel for you is maybe a few weeks later or a couple of months ahead, it feels maybe about January, about the middle of January, when it feels that it is really completed. And then between now and that time, use this time to gather your strength, quietly think about the next project, quietly think about what you are going to do. You might be having a conversation in your very, very close circle, but not yet putting it out on the, on the big uh, platform. Okay, so... Um, Yes, we are very, very close. <laughs> Thank you. That's number one. Okay. Number two, for number two people, I'm also getting number three and four. And then for you, I'm getting something different. For you, I need to look into the mirror. And then I'm feeling I'm postponing looking into the mirror. I'm postponing some kind of inner work, some kind of reflective work. I'm also postponing what I, what I thought I'm going to give to myself. And I'm also postponing that because I feel it. I also feel that there is some 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 doubts, some self doubts creeping in, creeping on, and every time when you say now now I'm going to you know I'm going to nurture myself, I deserve that, but then it always evaporates, you know, dissolves itself. So what spirit is saying that you use the first coming three four days, just relax. You need to relax in your body. You need to possibly slow down a little bit, but definitely relaxing into your body and and then also watching your boundaries with people. You know, sometimes we just have to do that. We, we need to close the door. We need to pull the curtain. We need to close the windows. And we just need to create that space just for ourselves. Because I feel that while I'm doing this, that nourishment is coming to you, coming to your heart. And then once you, once you regain your strength and confidence and then your own energy, your own balance, then from that space, it is much easier to move forward. I also feel that you are quite a, like a giving person, a giver, giver. And what Spit is saying that, you know, it's, it's all okay to give, give things out to people, you know, to give your love and give your attention. But maybe make sure that you keep something for yourself, you know, you are nurturing your heart. 
as well as nurturing others. Okay, now number two, nine of cups. I also need to, yes, I know that I'm keeping my, my ideas up there, but what Spirit is saying, that you know, just bring it down to yourself. Pick one of the cups. Doesn't matter which cup you are taking for yourself. I feel it's more to do with self-love and self-respect. And whichever you are taking or picking out of the, the, the selection, just take, take one, start with one, start with one. And then how the different cups will show their ways to you. Uh, in, in the sense that they are going to um, come to your awareness, they are going to, Spirit is giving you signs what you need to do next to, to, to really nourish yourself, you know? So, gorgeous card, number two, thank you. Now, number three, number three, I'm feeling you are a storyteller, and I feel that you have generated those stories, your ideas within yourself, somehow the objectively understanding, okay? And the speaker is making a reference, giving me a reference to stories. So I need to, I need to start formulating the ideas and then I need to put them out in words, okay? So it's whether I write and or I, I, I share what I write, or the text, or I stand up and then I say, say what I need to say, but it feels more of uh, using your imagination and I feel that you are also very good at uh, putting your 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 own um, uh, your own words into a different context, so a wider audience is understanding it, um, and not necessarily feeling very objective things, but then you are making it quite general for um, a wider audience to understand your 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 ideas and think thinking. Okay, I also feel that you are a thinker, and sometimes we just. Uh, Spirit is saying that yes, just nudge yourself and then allow yourself that 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 creativ creativity of who you are to come forward and really combine with your thinking. Okay, so we are creative here. I also feel that I need to yes, definitely need to reach out to communities and need to reach out to people. Uh, maybe you you might be a person who's working with children or thinking about reaching out to communities or working with children or different youth settings because I feel that you, you are a very very natural. Uh, person in this way, how you are tuning, you are able to tune into other people's energy very, very playfully, very, very easily, and then in very discreet, discreet um, energy. Not, I'm not feeling a push, pushing or pushed energy here. It is very, very natural. Okay, and then I, you need to bring yourself forward a little bit more as we move into next year. And then the card, card number three is a Queen of Pentacles. Okay, so even though we got a Queen here um, sitting back. And, and, and enjoying what she has created, uh, but then at the same time, yes, it's what else can I do? You know? So if I have one coin here, where is the next one? What can I do with the next one? Or what can I do with this one? So that I'm sharing it and giving it out to people. Okay, so it's time to open the door. It's time to pick up the phone. It's time to uh, have conversations with people and just putting yourself, putting yourself out there. Okay, so we have three cards here. I hope you enjoyed this little impromptu reading. If you liked it, or if you felt that it was it was interesting or useful, please come back and visit this page again, and um, and uh, look out for other other posts here. Thank you very much. Oh yes, the the, the website, my website and information you can find everything in the in the bio section. Thank you for your attention and have a gorgeous day and see you very soon. Thank you. Bye bye.